I'm going to take a look at Revell's Scooby-Doo's biplane. This kit is 1 20th scale. It retails around $20 and it is available online or at your local hobby shop. I always start with the box. Uh, great box art. I call this standard box art as I could not find an artist who did it. There's the front. The uh, back of the box does show the uh, completed kit and some assembly and also what is available. Uh, next up, I'll start with the instructions. It's uh, black and white, almost uh, very straightforward. First page has the uh, part layout, and the instructions are uh, pretty self straightforward. Uh huh, uh huh. Figure guide. And the completed plane. Uh, the kit's molded in uh, multicolored uh, styrene. Uh, there's nothing on trees. Everything is uh, basically pre-painted. Uh, it does come poly-bagged, as you can see here. I left some in the bag just to show. Uh, this is where you get the uh, machine guns, the wheels, and the uh, tail. Uh, I'll start with the figures. Uh, you do get three figures. One is you get a different Scooby than you do with the uh, one that comes with the mystery machine. This Scooby has a flight hat. And the painting on it is pretty uh, not bad. Uh, Shaggy left him polybagged, but there he is. And I went ahead and assembled uh, Velma. Uh, that, of course, they are 120th scale. Uh, painting on it is pretty nice. Uh, my only uh, thing that I got to uh, mention here is for the junior modelers, you may have to help snap the uh, parts together. It is a little tight fit, but other, other than that, uh, it does fit extremely well. Uh, the plane itself, cowling. Uh, there's the seats. Uh, the engine, which uh, pretty detailed uh, for a snap fit kit and uh, no flash or anything of that nature. Uh, struts. The uh, propeller. Uh, the plane itself is actually, uh, uh, the wings do have uh, flaps that go on them. That was very cool. And uh, you can feel the ridge of the uh, biplane uh, frame. The tail fin. The uh, main body. And a uh, detail on it is very sharp. Uh, basically a solid stout kit. Very uh, not flimsy at all. Bottom of the plane, and it does come with a set of stickers for the control panels, and they are peel and stick. They are not decals, which are water slide. These are peel and stick, like that. Uh, absolutely, a, a great kit for beginners and experienced modelers. I highly recommend the Scooby-Doo biplane.